What is cholesterol? Cholesterol is a substance that is found in the blood. Everyone has some. It is needed for good health. The problem is, people sometimes have too much cholesterol. Compared with people with normal cholesterol, people with high cholesterol have a higher risk of heart attacks, strokes, and other health problems. The higher your cholesterol, the higher your risk of these problems. Are there different types of cholesterol? Yes, there are a few different types. If you get a cholesterol test, you might hear your doctor or nurse talk about total cholesterol, LDL cholesterol. Some people call this the bad cholesterol. That's because having high LDL levels raises your risk of heart attacks, strokes, and other health problems. HDL cholesterol. Some people call this the good cholesterol. That's because people with high HDL levels tend to have a lower risk of heart attacks, strokes, and other health problems. Non-HDL cholesterol. Non-HDL cholesterol is your total cholesterol minus your HDL cholesterol. Triglycerides. Triglycerides are not cholesterol. They are another type of fat, but they often get measured when cholesterol is measured. What is normal value of each cholesterol? Ask your doctor or nurse what your numbers should be. Different people need different goals according to risk factors of cardiovascular complication. Total cholesterol below 200. HDL cholesterol above 60. Triglycerides below 150. LDL cholesterol below 130 in healthy people. Below 100 if they are at risk of heart attacks or strokes. Below 70 if they are at risk of heart attacks or strokes. Keep in mind though that many people who cannot meet these goals still have a low risk of heart attacks and strokes. What should I do if my doctor tells me I have high cholesterol? Ask your doctor what your overall risk of heart attacks and strokes is. High cholesterol by itself is not always a reason to worry. Having high cholesterol is just one of many things that can increase your risk of heart attacks and strokes. Other factors that increase your risk include cigarette smoking, high blood pressure, having a parent, sister, or brother who got heart disease at a young age. Young in this case means younger than 55 for men and younger than 65 for women. A diet that is not heart healthy. A heart healthy diet includes lots of fruits and vegetables, fiber and healthy fats, like those found in fish and certain oils. It also means limiting sugar and unhealthy fats. Older age. If you are at high risk of heart attacks and strokes, having high cholesterol is a problem. On the other hand, if you are at low risk, having high cholesterol might not lead to treatment. Should I take medicine to lower cholesterol? Not everyone who has high cholesterol needs medicines. Your doctor will decide if you need them based on your age, family history, and other health concerns. You should probably take a cholesterol-lowering medicine called a statin if you already had a heart attack or stroke, have known heart disease, have diabetes, have a condition called peripheral artery disease, which makes it painful to walk and happens when the arteries in your legs get clogged with fatty deposits. Have an abnormal aortic aneurysm, which is a widening of the main artery in the belly. Most people with any of the conditions listed above should take a statin no matter what their cholesterol level is. If your doctor or nurse puts you on a statin, stay on it. The medicine might not make you feel any different, but it can help prevent heart attacks, strokes, and death.